Yo, yo, how's everyone doing? Welcome, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. How's everybody doing today? Hello, Trick. How you doing? All right, so basic uh, movement. You have your D-pad moves you, turns you around here. Uh, each one of your different directions on the thumbstick will open up like a different menu. So, you know, left opens your inventory, up brings up your quest down will be like your different um, notes and you know markers and stuff like that and then um, right takes you to like your skills and abilities hello hello welcome yeah this game is uh, it takes a few minutes to get started but um definitely an old school grid based uh, dungeon crawler but it's I've had a lot of fun I played for about an hour yesterday and uh, so I just went ahead and started over here so people can see it from the beginning, but um, but yeah, I've really enjoyed it. But uh, you can also strafe with the right thumbstick, and then look up and down. You can bring up different your different menus by pressing the bumpers here, left and right, or you can just use your trigger uh, to swing your swords, which is pretty nice. When you open your inventory here, you'll get different items that you can then, you know, uh, you can equip them to the different sides by just pressing whichever bumper. Smiley, what's up, buddy? So yeah, uh, honestly, the game is really, really fun. Uh, and it, it's $17.99, which is, uh, you know, understandably, some people feel a little bit expensive, but to me, uh, as a single developer, he's done a great job here. So yeah, you just you can talk to different NPCs and pick up quests. You know, like fetch quests and things of that nature. Yeah, here's your inventory where you can store, you know, things that you find along the way cuz you of course have you know, a limited inventory. Yo, what's up, Mario? Hey, buddy. And then also you have these, like, teleport pads that you can find. And it looks like there's kind of a lot of different places to go, so... Pretty excited to get into this one more and more. When you come to spots like this where there's two things, if you just hit the X button, it'll rotate through them. It also features the touch uh, touch screen if you don't want to use it. I'm using it in docked mode now, but you can definitely use it in touch screen. Slade, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. How is everybody today? Everybody doing well? Can you hear me? Is the uh, game audio and the microphone okay? Let me go ahead and make the... Just go ahead and... Chat box. Right over. Let's have it come up over top of that other chat there, I guess.
Wonderful, Mario, man. I missed you, buddy. We've been trying to hit you up for all last night, man. <laughs> See you, Cartoon. Thank you, buddy. Take care, my friend. Oh, yeah. So here you go. We got a couple things we can equip. So if you hit the A button to bring up a tool tip on them, and you can just hit the bumper and just equip them right to whatever side you want. So we'll just put them over there with Harlan first. <laughs> See you, buddy. Oh, Lemons, what's up, buddy? What happened, man? I didn't realize that was you at all, dude. What's up, buddy? I hope you've been well, man. Oh, yeah, this is kind of cool. So each character, you'll come across these books that teach you new abilities. And you can learn them for a single skill point, but you, you can learn them on both characters or just one. So you could make one like a uh, warrior and one like a mage. Then once you learn them, you just hit the Y button and you can put them right on your little tooltip. You know, your little menu there. And then if you just hit the bumper, go to it, uh, tell it to queue up and hit the X button to start. It'll use a little of your mana, but it will do an AOE heal for the party, which is awesome. This game is so good. Why'd you quit, man? Oh, you just don't feel like it anymore, dude? You were doing so well, man. Plus, I loved your videos. Adri, how you doing, buddy? <laughs> yeah, it's been a little bit, man. Started back up full-time at work, man, and just been trying to keep up with everything else, you know? But uh, I definitely wanted to show this game off. Mainly because of the price. I'm afraid a lot of people would just overlook it because of the price, which I understand. lemons man take care of yourself my friend you're always welcome here buddy Yeah, man, you always can come back and hang out whenever you want, buddy. Oh, nice. Now the thumbsticks, if you look up there, there's two uh, health potions on either side. 
um, if you tap in, you know, if you hit the R3 or the L3, the thumbsticks, it will uh, use whatever consumable you have in that uh, in that slot there. Yeah, me too, Ashby. Yeah, actually, so Trick, I talked to the developer myself, and um, he's a wonderful dude. And I told him a lot of people on the Discord, they really like the game, but they feel like it's a little too expensive, you know? And he's, he assured me that he's working with Nintendo. They have rules in place for how often you can put the game on sale and stuff. But he said he's going to drop it down to $9.99 for everyone. Because that seems to be a good price everybody mentioned on Discord, that they would feel a little more comfortable at $9.99. And so um, I asked him an email. I just said, would you consider doing it? He told me that he just has to work within the rules of Nintendo, but that he would love uh, to put it back on sale as soon as possible. And as soon as he does, I will definitely put it on the list. Because for real. So this, I know this looks a little bit, you know, microtransaction-y, but it's just in-game in stuff. I haven't found anything where you can spend real money. It's just the gems that you find in the game. The game was originally a mobile game that he has, he's been working on it since he was a kid. Um, it's been a passion project of his since he was young. He's put everything into this and then he after the um, the Android and iOS stuff He's decided to port it over here to the switch So I mean this is like a single developer with a passion for what he's doing really really great product It's just you know, it's a little steep for most people and I would agree like I think 1799 is a little steep um, But it is a quality product though if that you know if that makes any difference to people you know yeah yeah <laughs> yeah he sure did miss out man oh shoot oh well that's fine I just upgraded it on accident that's okay All right, so we got a key. Oh, yeah, we gotta get that. Ugh. All right, so yeah, see, we took a little bit of damage here, so I can just go ahead and have him heal us up. I think we just got the key to this. Oh yeah, so I also, um, he gave, uh, the gentleman gave me an extra code, uh, so we did, last night we did a giveaway for it, and actually, uh, Montana's in the, the chat here, and so I asked the guy, I was like, you know, do I, do you mind if I do a giveaway for the game, the extra code that you gave me, and he said sure, so, um, I wasn't gonna say anything, but he asked if I would, um, you know, he just said, you know, I prefer if you're gonna tell people, just let them know on a live stream. So, um, yeah, just want to let everyone know that Montana also has a copy of the game, uh, courtesy of the developer. So I hope he likes it. Hope you like it, buddy. This is totally different from last time I played. That's pretty cool. points out thing oh yeah yeah Mario uh, we had Montana dude we try to hit you up also man check your uh, private messages man because I sent you something that sounds awesome oh my gosh I'm getting surrounded oh no That could have been lights out. We were in trouble there. Made it. Ah. 
Yeah, actually, so, um, I think you can actually turn off some of that stuff. So, like, I could turn this off because I don't need those off. I can turn off the message window because you don't need that. Yeah, so you can clean it up a little bit, which isn't bad. That's actually a lot better. And, yeah, you play as two people, so if you press the left bumper, you can control, you know, character one, and then the right bumper controls two. So what you can do when you get these abilities, right, is, uh, let me see if I can remember the ability. Nope. All right. So when you press right on the thumbstick, you can bring up your ability chart here. And as you find these abilities through the game, you can assign them by pressing ZL or ZR to whichever character that you want to assign them to. So you could have one that focuses on magic and one that focuses on, you know, physical abilities. It's actually really cool. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, he's put a lot of work into it. Like I say, I, I, I know the price is there, but it's just, he's really done a lot. All right, so we'll need some eye socket or eyeballs to put in those empty sockets, it sounds like. Oh yeah, okay, so here's the teleport circles. So you can teleport back to the blacksmith, you know, to craft things or whatever, and then come right back. <gasps> oh, no, there's... Oh, okay. That's too much. Ah. Out of here, that's too much. Yeah, and see, like, some of them will require level 6, or they take a lot of skill points that you don't have yet. No, I didn't even ask him because I, I just figured I'll go ahead and play it, Montana. I should have asked. I kind of wanted to, but I was just like, you know what? I don't even want to um, make him think I'm just trying to, like, you know, have some quick information or anything like that. So I was like, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, and just play it. It doesn't say anything online anywhere either. So then again, I didn't look at the iOS version to see if they had, like, a playtime for that. Oh, nice haste. Also, I wanted to mention I'm playing with the Elitist S. It's from Big Big One. They've sent it to me. I'm going to do a review on it. I'm going to go film some more footage today and have a review out hopefully this week for it. But yeah, this is absolutely an amazing controller for like a fraction of the Pro Controller's cost. <laughs> it's got all kinds of cool features too. Plus, it hooks up to Apple, Android, your computer. You can hook it up with their little wireless adapter to like any system you want. 
crazy. Yo, Prof, how you doing? Yeah, this is definitely old school, old school RPG, grid based and everything, yep. So the, all you do when you go up there is it just takes you to a cemetery that you can't go any further. There's a couple people to talk to up there, but we'll just keep messing around in here for now. Now that is actually a pretty good one. That gives you AOE um, abilities on your physical attacks. So yeah, like turning and strafing, you know, um, you can kind of dance around the enemies once you get used to the controls, of course. Strafe with your thumbstick here on the right and then turn with the D-pad. So sometimes you get it mixed up when you're getting into battle and stuff. If my voice is getting too much, just let me know. Uh, I'll calm down on it. <laughs> Renee, what's up, Omi? How you doing? Mm-hmm. You sure did. Hello, hello. So, um, Renee, I talked to the developer. He said he's going to do a sale for for nine ninety nine. As soon as Nintendo lets him do it. He promised me. He promised me. Right there, I messed up. See? Tried to dance and messed up. Yeah, we're in the spider part. Any dungeon crawler probably gonna be infested with spiders. This one changes right here, too. This one got me last night. That's the part where I yelled at the screen. I was like, whoa. <laughs> oh, oh, man, he's got me in the corner. Oh, no. Let me get out of here. Oh man, I need to heal myself. And activate that. Oh my goodness, what was that? I didn't even I don't even know what that blue bolt was. But yeah, I mean even the animations and stuff to me are really good. Yeah, this guy you gotta dance around a lot. He's got a lot of health. Yeah, he really is. He told me, he promised, man. And he's, I told you, I've talked to him a couple times. He seems like such a good dude. He, he like literally in the email said that he, he gave me a second key to give to Little Man, but he's just not quite ready for a game like this yet. that we found along the way here. And then this stuff, I think you can just press the, like the select or negative button and it'll just drop it or something. 
yep you press a and then just press select and it'll drop it all right so now we got our inventory cleared out a little bit killed us a spider big spider for renee I don't, I don't know yet, uh, Professor. I'm not sure yet if you get any of that stuff. Um, but there are like, uh, you know, dungeon traps and stuff, of course, as you would expect. I've ran into some stuff like that, so. But uh, I'm not sure if you get to actually lay anything down yet. You can like socket your items and stuff, though. I do know that they have sockets and stuff in them, so. There's definitely a lot to it. Hold on, what was that? Spirit, vitality, power, okay, that's good. Power should go there. Spirit, defense, luck. Yeah, defense. Cool. Power and defense is good with me. So you see on the tool tip here on the right-hand side, it'll tell you if it gives you some bonuses. You know, because some items are rare, some are uncommon, some are epic, some are legendary. That kind of thing. See how the orange is legendary? And then you've got, you know, your base ones that have, they're just, un they're regular common, you know. Um, and then, like, the stuff that we're equipped here is blue, that's rare. You know, the purple's epic, so on and so forth. You know, standard standard stuff. This was just a dead end, right? And we already clicked that? Yeah, okay. totally forgot see just like that there it is I might have to heal myself now so I just walked right through that like a dummy oh nice enchant enchant that was just so entirely smart of me you know nice got a new weapon yeah, exactly, man. I t <laughs> just go ahead, you know, just run right into it, why don't you? <laughs> yeah, man. Alright, what key do we need? Let's go. I don't think you can this. Oh, did I? Uh... to go now we killed this spider so let's just go ahead and go back here and see if there's anywhere we missed i don't think there are this is yeah we just went there i mean i don't think so but i might have missed something nope I still don't have the key for that i'm not sure if you get a key in the cemetery i can't quite remember But yeah, man, I, I hope everyone is enjoying at least the gameplay, because um, it really is a fun game. And when it goes on sale, I hope some people will at least give it a chance. I think you'll enjoy it. If you like the genre, you know, I mean, you have to really enjoy this. You can, you're not going to like it if you don't like the genre, no, you know, nothing to it. But I thought it would be a cool one to show to people. Yeah, it looks like you can even spend gold on upgrades here. I don't really know much about that, but...
No, yeah, no question. I get that for sure. Plus, you know, we do like, we focus on sales here. So, and this one isn't on sale. It's just, I wanted to show it off for the developer because he was such a cool, like a good dude to me, you know, so nice to me and stuff. So I wanted to give him some love. That's all really it comes down to. $17.99 right now, but um, the developer has assured me he will, as soon as possible, get it on sale for uh, $9.99. He just has to uh, wait for Nintendo to allow it. How you doing, Jerry? <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> yeah, this guy, I haven't really messed with him too much, but he allows you to trade in items for other items. understand that feeling entirely mm -hmm. yeah that's the best bet that's the best bet I'll take the blame for it all right so he's gonna give us some quests Cool. And then this, I, I couldn't figure out if I'm supposed to be able to go any further past here, but I couldn't figure it out, if so. Maybe I need to use something in the inventory here. sure but you can do this and it changes the color <laughs> for something <laughs> oh yeah for sure man for sure so I'm not sure what to do there yet I'll have to figure that one out oh yeah yeah for sure a key somewhere that we didn't get. Just think about it. Yeah, Ultra Age looks great too. Oh my goodness. Ooh. 
Perfect timing. Gotta love it. We found a key. I don't remember finding another one, but okay, cool. Yeah, Renee, Renee, for sure, you know. I had to go live again. It's been too long. And this one, you know. You know how I felt about this one. I had to show it. Mario, did you have a good night, buddy? Oh, this is a big boy. With the big old club in his hand. Ooh, good thing, because I was out of space. Gloves, all right, I'll take them. Brutal strike, nice. All right, cool, man. Good deal. Should I learn that? Yes. Awesome. Got lightning orb, magic arrow. I can't learn yet. What have we not learned over here? He's got everything. Maybe I should upgrade the heal. That'll work. Basic attack should be upgraded properly. Alright, that'll work. Oh, yeah, and I haven't even figured this out yet how this works. The mastery map below. Ooh, yeah. I'm not sure about this one. Group heal cooldown. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so how many points do I have here? Mastery points three for him and three for him. Oh, man. Yo, thanks, Montana. Appreciate you, man. You gotta stop giving me money, bro, please. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you, man. I love you, dude. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and learn some power here. Oh, okay, so when you unlock... Ah, dude. Wow. Yeah, this is such a good game. Oh, I don't want to learn that one on him, but I'll learn that one. Oh, man, and you can learn each one on... Oh, my goodness. Wow. Wow. Well done. Victor uh, Damani, well done, my friend. And thank you so much for the, the lovely emails, man. Wow, this is an amazing game. Mm. Oh, yeah, definitely want to get that. Boom. For both of them, they both swing them swords for now. Wow, yeah, dude, this, this, there's just so much to this. Wow. Mm. where we came in from. I can't even tell anymore. I'm getting lost now. Oh, just one too early. Let's go ahead and try this out. Yeah. Bow. Oh, he hit me. Yeah, and it's so peaceful. It's not like super fast pace over the top, you know. It's just a nice dungeon crawler, man. Oh, and this is the thing. There's even a mini game. It looks like I haven't gone in yet, but look, there's even this thing called the pits that I found last night, and here we are again. But it looks like there's even a way to go down and do like different levels against like you know spiders, wraiths, and then ogres, blah blah blah, you know, so on and so forth. And look how many levels. This is like a whole. It looks like it's a whole other mini game that you can play. Wild. Wild, wild, wild. Yeah, this is a fantastic game. Yeah, and I have to figure out how to do the crafting and stuff. I haven't even got into all that yet either. Wow. go get that teleport pad first yeah I don't even think I saw this last night yeah thank you so much Montana you know how you know how it is man But we did, um, thanks to some help from the viewers, we did go ahead and clean up the UI a little bit here. But you don't need the movement buttons unless you're playing with touchscreen. You know, you really don't need them. And that's another thing. He's giving you options to remove some of that junk that you don't need if you're not playing that way. So, I mean, he's really done. Yeah, he's done a good job. Wow, I am lost. Okay, so this just looks like it's... Oh! Whoa! Oh yeah, that's much better with that cooldown reduced by just that 5%. It's so much faster still. Don't look safe. But I guess it's all right. Man, I'm getting lost. We definitely need a map. Oh my goodness. Sounded like it hurt. <laughs> I definitely don't want to get caught in the corner there. I think there's a. Okay. Sweet. I'll take it. All that just. Okay. What did I get from that book? Something had to be. Had to be something cool, right? Haste potion. Okay. 
just a consumable. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man, you've been awesome, dude. We've got some awesome people, really do, in our community. That's why I always say it, man. The people here are really, really cool. Except for one crummy gamer. She's a superstar. She's not just regular cool, you know what I mean? <laughs> just checking on to see if you fell asleep. I'm lost. So, oh, wow. That does not look very promising. Ooh, hit him with that critical. Oops, sorry if that was loud in your ear. That kind of got me down. I'm so lost. All looks the same. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Blah. Yeah, take that. Blah. I'm gonna have to store some stuff at that blacksmith soon. I'm running out of space here. Hold on, what is, what is going on? You got multiple spots? I did. Okay, never mind. You got plenty of space. More recipes. Yeah, I want that power one. Boom. Boom. Oh, shield. Nice. Oh, I had some epic boots. I didn't even know that. Definitely. Yo, what's up, Jeff? How you doing, bud? Congratulations, my friend. I see you rolling. I love this game, Jeff. For real. The developer is an amazing dude, and he has done some great work here. Oh, so here's another thing. Wild Lair, where you can test your strength. Wow. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that, man. I'm not going to know. There we go. The voiceless dungeon. Oh, they come back when you come back. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> that critical is crucial. Oh, my goodness. Maybe I should just make them both warriors for now. I don't know. Ogre heart. Oh, no. Yo, Andrew, what's up, buddy? How you doing, man? Welcome to the show. I just uh, respawned these guys. Yep, I knew it. And I don't have my crit this time. That's right, we'll just dance around them for a little bit. Oh. You got your buddy coming into the party.
I guess we were headed back that way anyway, huh? Hi, Tanisha, how you doing? Jeff, that was an awesome uh, Q&A live stream you did, by the way, man. That was a great time, dude. I mean, not live stream, but from here. I wish you could like take that and put that down in the corner now that you don't have the, like the move buttons or the uh, chat box but maybe you can i don't know Yes, sir, man. You're always welcome, buddy. You know that. Everybody still doing all right out there? <laughs> I'm loving the game. I don't know what else to say.
Oh, Andrew, Michigan, man. I got some good friends in real, um, not real life, I guess I should say. They were local friends, but now they moved back home to Michigan. Uh, yeah, can't get anything from this guy either. some stuff or something. Sweet, and you can just click the right thumbstick to sell all of the like just you know vendor fodder. Oh, that's freaking amazing! Do they have a way to um, so yeah, and you can even sort things? That's awesome! Oh man, great job! Great job! Wow, so good! I love this, man. I'm really enjoying it. some sort. I don't know anybody in Wisconsin, sadly. Except for you, I guess. I know you know.
He's resistant. <laughs> oh, there's two more of them. Did that just take me back to the beginning? Skills and that other guy. Yo, what's up, Death? How you doing, brother? Yeah, man, for real, this game is amazing, dude. If you get a chance, like, you know, and you just want to kill some time, go back and, um, you know, some point and just check, like, the beginning of it. Out. Gosh darn it. Um, go back and check, like, the beginning of it out so just you can see, like, how it starts off if you want. But yeah, this game is, I think it'd be right up your alley, too, man, based on our conversations. That's a lot. They just happened to be weak enough that I didn't die, but that was definitely certain doom. Like, with a stronger opponent, that would have been lights out.
Dang it. Oh my goodness. Wrong button. I guess that kind of worked out okay though. Oh man, Death. Nah, no, um, little man put a veto on that. We're not allowed to play uh, Fortnite here. <laughs> See, what happened is when he was younger, you know how cousins are, right? And so his cousins liked Fortnite and told him that Minecraft was a bad game, right? So they have like a rivalry where he thinks Minecraft is the best game in the world. His cousins thinks Fortnite. So we're not allowed to even talk about Fortnite. <laughs> But yeah, so I mean, I hope everybody has enjoyed the gameplay. I mean, this, um, I just wanted to give the guy some love, you know. Because, man, he did, he did some great work here. It looks like we found, I mean, there's all of the different, the dungeon crawl aspects, the quest aspects, the crafting, the story, the inventory, all of that. But then uh, it looks like we also found two like additional game modes that are hidden within the actual dungeons themselves. Yeah, no question that that's how it goes, man. You know how it is. Super Animal Royale. Okay, I'll check that one out, Tanisha. I was actually thinking about playing this game called Super Treasure Arena with him. Which is just like a little, you know, it's like a tournament based little dungeon crawler mini thing for four players. But it's all these great games that are four players, right? They just need, like, just give us online or something. Games like, um, what was that one? Kung, uh, Boomerang Fu and, uh, the other ones that are a lot like it, all those games that they had four player though, online, you know. Yeah, so the guy's name is Victor Damani, the gentleman who made this. Great dude. Passion project, you can feel it in the game. You can tell he's put a lot of work into it. It's not just slapped together, it's not just shovelware, you know. Only thing I wish maybe he changes the um the cover art on the eShop because it's not very like uh, it doesn't really grip people you know yeah death hang tight maybe because uh, like I say the guy he's assured me as soon as he can he's gonna drop it to 999 um, but I told him you know I, I, for me personally I think the game now I probably wouldn't have going out and purchased it for $18. I probably would never it would have just looked overlooked it and kept going. But uh now that I played it, you know, I could definitely say that he's he's put in the work, you know. He deserves to to get some love for that, but you know, some $18 you get a lot of really good games. You can get you know, six or seven really good games for $2, you know, so It's really cool Tanisha, but or uh Death, but you know, you have to you, you you need some people to play with, you know? So if you got some buddies or like, you know, the little ones want to play or any of those kinds of things, yeah. And, uh, yeah, man, so, I don't know. But I'd, I'd be definitely be interested to hear what you have to say about it, Montana, when you get a chance to play it. The only thing to keep in mind, you can only have one save file per, you know, like account that you, you log into on the Switch. So you have to continue your story or start over brand new. Like I had to start over 
and erase all of the game that we played yesterday, so. Yo, Joker, what's up, buddy? Welcome, my friend. Welcome to the Discord as well, buddy. Tanisha, we have Montana, Joker, and Death all join uh, the Discord this week. So uh, the Discord's been just getting better and better. You definitely have to come hang out with us sometime. Even join the, the voice chat if you want, Tanisha or Joker. If you're shy, just put it on mute. You can listen to our antics if you want to. Yeah, for sure, brother. And also, man, congrats. You know what I'm talking about. Congrats, man. Ha <laughs> ha, good job. Yeah, you know you're always welcome, Tanisha. And we'd love to talk to you anytime you want. We, 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 you know, we're cool. We're not gonna give you a hard time. We might joke on you a little bit, but that's just out of love. Also, um, Renee, she's, um, I know you had like some of those videos, you know, like on your channel. Um, she's kind of into similar things, so. Wow, he just hit me hard. Cannot allow that to happen again, goodness. I bait that all too far away. Probably should have heal on both characters in all honesty at this point. Oh, too far away. They're not on the same grid as you either, so you gotta keep that in mind. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I figured you did. I figured y'all would bond, you know, because Renee, you know how Renee is. She's super charismatic. Oh, that is not true. He did not hit me. I was way out of there. Don't hit me again, though, man, because I can't die. Gotta get this heal off. I always quiet there. Act like Muhammad Ali for a few minutes, folks. Stick and move, stick and move. Get out of there. Oh yeah. Got you now. <laughs> Joker, yeah, man. <laughs> Virtual high five, buddy. Virtual high five. You know what I'm saying? You're a genius. Oh, he's throwing stuff. Oh, there's two throwing things. Oh, what is happening? I'm gonna do. 
because this is just, just making it harder. Oh no, 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 no points. They really want me dead. So that's the wild lair. Nice, nice, nice. I think we got like five, six in there or something. Not bad. But yeah. Yeah, same, yeah. Actually, I ended up getting the Quake Enhanced Edition. I just, um, I know I'm supposed to be playing it for Renee. I just haven't done it yet. But I plan to play that real soon. And show it off and stuff. I don't remember how much it was. I think it was cheap though. I think it was on sale or something recently. They're all starting to blend together now. Oh yeah, death. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Mm-hmm. Well, this was a pretty fun time on a Monday. Sorry it was on a Monday and not a Sunday when people are off and stuff like that, but um, I don't know, I just was kind of busy over the weekend and stuff, so I didn't get a chance. But I wanted to make sure to go live before it had been, you know, too much longer because it had been like a week since we got a chance to go live with everyone. And uh, this and doing like a premiere where people can jump into the live chat while the video is playing, which is kind of weird for me to hear my voice while I'm, you know, watching and hanging out with you guys, but it's the best to actually be able to connect with everybody that's why i try to tell everybody if you want come into the discord hang out with us you don't have to talk you know you can just hang out and kind of get to know everybody a little bit we have a great community of people that have uh you know not only on the channel but over in discord that just you know they talk about games all day they talk about random stuff all day so if you have a question or if you're curious about a game you can jump in there and they'll for real they'll answer they'll help you out so Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well done. And yeah, keep an eye on this one. If this looks interesting, keep an eye on it uh, for when it drops on sale. Or if you feel like dropping the $17.99, like I say, I think you'll get plenty of gameplay out of it. It's just, you know, you got to weigh that on like something like Eastward that's coming out in a couple days. That's only a few dollars more. Who knows which one you like more, but you know what I mean. But so far, first impressions, this is a great game. I haven't got to the end, so I, you know, I couldn't give you like a full review of it. But for real, I mean, I don't know what more you can ask for in a game like this. So he's really, he's giving you everything you could ask for in a dungeon crawler, if you like the genre, you know, so. But yeah, I mean, I hate to say goodbye, this is the worst part of any live stream, but I really do appreciate everyone hanging out, chatting with us, talking, you know, back and forth amongst each other and stuff like that. Um, when we get somebody new that comes in and you guys always give them a great, you know, like a warm welcome, make them feel like part of the crew. So I truly appreciate that. Yeah, I, I, it's definitely a sale game, I think, Joker, you know, for sure. Yeah, Andrew, if you get a chance for real, check out you know just kind of skim through and check out some different parts uh but yeah it's awesome i don't know how long you were actually able to watch the gameplay itself but but yeah definitely if you're in if anybody is curious get a chance just check out you know a couple parts or whatever of it but yeah but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and end the stream here i really do appreciate you all hanging out and uh and you know thank you to uh victor Damani, thank you so much, buddy. I appreciate it. This is a great game. You can definitely feel your passion in it if you get a chance to watch this or if you're watching now. Well done, man. And thank you for uh, hooking Little Man up. That was awesome of you, too, for real. Yeah, take care, Andrew. Appreciate you, buddy. Yeah, Hexen was awesome, too, man. Great job. Yep, yep. Another old school one, yeah. All right, folks. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And uh, we'll see you soon on the next video or the premiere or next time we go live, whatever. 
But thank you all so much, for real. Have a great day. See you later. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> for sure. All right, folks.